That's why that Free Willy shit was so stupid. Did you see that movie? That was the stupidest movie. And why people were so dramatic about it. Willie, let Willie go, you bastard. Free Willy! I went to the premiere and fucked it up. I still said, fuck Willie, I want my goddamn freedom. I no goddamn well. That nigga close out the stab, Willie, he'll be a pair of shoes. And it is the end of the world. I know that because I saw a Chinese man driving a school bus on the other side of the street taking pictures, so I know it's the end of the world. And don't worry about me because I'm being punished. I live in a white neighborhood and I got to move because they won't go to sleep till I come home. They're waiting now. Sometimes I don't come home for three, four nights. But it is in the world and I don't like Bette Midler and I don't like Goldie Hawn. I'm going to tell you why. Because both of them bitches are always in the movies talking about save the world, save the planet. Do you know how much balls it takes to say you're going to save Earth? Earth is billions of years old, okay? Man is seven million years old. Birds are older than man. Earth don't have to listen to no baby. That's why it's fighting back. You can see the way the planet's happening. It's fighting back. So we got to save our goddamn selves. All right? And I blame it on white folks. I'm going to tell you why. Because you guys started out messing up the environment. Chopping trees down to build boats to go get niggas. And now that the picnic is over, you want us to help recycle. I'm not recycling shit. That's me on the highway. I throw shit out there all goddamn day. And there's no water shortage. They sell water at the store 24 hours. If it's a shortage, give me my goddamn share. I turned my water on when I left home. That's my bill. I water my lawn when it's raining. Fuck them. That's my bill. But now the black folks can afford to wear fur, they're going to make a fur law. They got people running around throw shit on your fur. So if you can throw it on somebody's black, you better be able to throw that shit in run because there's going to be some shit. And I want you guys just, it's... The basic line is it's not a cleanup, it's not a Sammy Davis dance and singing because I ain't going to do that. But we're in this together. We really are black and white and we might as well get used to it because uh, if we don't wrap it, we ain't going to be here. And that's just my little mess. I'm serious. We got to get it together. Latino. Brother. But you, hey, I, I just want to thank Andrew for having me on the show and I want to thank you for listening to what I have to say. And if you can relate to it, it's beautiful. If you can't, defend my right to say it. Thank you very much and peace. Peace out. You guys are very nice. Thank you. Mr. Paul Mooney, let's hear from I want to, uh, we got to wrap this up. I want to thank all of you for being here. In seriousness, I want to wish all the ladies in the house and all the ladies watching a very happy Valentine's Day. Where am I going? I got to go home and get late myself. I want to say thank you to all our ex. John Mulrooney and Mr. Paul Mooney. And of course, Lee Lawrence, ladies and gentlemen. Lee was phenomenal and I, I really... Lee Lawrence. God bless you. God bless you, Andrew. And thank you so much for having me on this show. No problem, Lee, really. May I, may I say something to the audience? Yeah, sure, go ahead. May I say something with all sincerity? I have done so many shows, so many, but I have never seen such a classy audience as yourselves. That's right, yes, yes. You know something, as I said, it makes me believe the old saying, many, many are called, however, few are chosen. For the chosen few, I am so excited about the excitement that I can't stand it. I want you to give a big hand for classy people such as yourself. Let me hear it for you. Yes. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Believe me, I'm giving you all a standing ovation. You know, as Gloria said to me, Gloria said that when you come here, when you arrive in New York, you're going to meet people like you've never seen before. You know something? Gloria was right. Oh, God bless you too, thank you. I want you to know that I'm excited, real excited, and I thank you for inviting me and all those of you that requested me. Thank you. Thank you so much. So much. You're what? Oh, thank you so much. Is he wonderful? God bless you all.
You can stay in bed and lose your head, it's sexy. You can stay in bed and lose your head in torment. Makes you wonder if it's worth it at all. Yeah, you started out so nice and right and sexy. Halfway through, it ain't quite right no more. Makes you wonder why you do it anymore. Cause when it ends, the feelings always linger It stings for a while, but soon the hearts will mend Makes you wonder, is it ever gonna end? Do you be nice? right do you be free at all I think next time I might hide that one thing not right and never bring it up at all <laughs>